Hi there, digital marketers. Welcome back to my channel. Today we have got an advanced tutorial for you. We are going to walk through the process of setting up the new content event for TikTok Pixel using Google Tag Manager. So let's get started. Before set up the view content event, firstly we have to confirm that the data layer is on or off. If you go to the our Google Tag Manager plugins, here I put in the Google Tag Manager ID and container code on off that will be the on and then integrations WooCommerce. Here track classic e-commerce will be tick mark track enhance e-commerce will be the tick mark now we are test that our data layer is working or not here is our google tag manager go to the preview continue and here see tag assistant is connected if we are go to the single product view content soothing sunscreen gel which is open now check it out our tag assistant this is working on not view item here look soothing sunscreen gel is already we found the data layer item id is 369 item name price item category all of data now we are go to the, our tiktok official website then here all are mentioned that for view content event which parameter you have to need so look at out here is view content this is a view content here we look at that the parameters are required which parameters one is content type second one is quantity description that will be not required for enhanced e-commerce content ID that will be essential currency value so we are creating the parameters from our data layer here is our data layer and you can create the parameters which content type will be the product and content id that means item id these parameters is required item name these parameters also required and the currency then also need the value so how can we can create then we are go to the tag manager and creating the parameters firstly variables new variables create data layer variables firstly we are creating the content id that means item id here you are look at that e-commerce then items then items id so we are picking the e-commerce items here is a array for array we have picked the zero picking the item id so copy the e-commerce firstly e-commerce dot items dot for array we are picking zero and item id that will be elb item id yet then we are creating the item name the same process e-commerce items zero item id then we are creating the item name new data layer variable e-commerce dot items dot items dot zero dot item name blb item name Then again, new data layer variable e commerce dot currency will be currency. Save it, creating the value parameter data layer variable e commerce dot. Value. DLB value. Save it. We are creating the triggers. 
new custom event which event we have to track that is view item so we are at event as view item paste it so event view item save it view item then you will go to the final step that is tags which are which are want to track new we are finding the tiktok pixel from the community template gallery search tiktok here you can see tiktok pixel that is authored by the tiktok so we are taking this template click it add to workspace and add so here is a tiktok event configuration firstly you have to pick the pixel id where we find out in the first video we are discussed about how to connect your tiktok pixel in the wordpress website by using gtm so i recommend it to you if you do not see the first video part one then please watching this video then you can understand how it is works so now here go to the tiktok app manager and here is our pixel id we are copy the id and go to the google tag then google tag manager here is a put the pixel id trigger event which event we have to trigger that must be the view content event a view content and object parameters that must be the single content content id we are creating the parameters just to put the content id parameters will be itemary we are creating content type that will be the product content name will be item name category that is necessary for the view content event quantity that will be the static only one i put it currency we are creating the currency dlb currency value we are creating the value also dlb value that will be not necessary deduplication that will be server side tracking triggering we are creating that trigger for view content event here is the event view item almost done we are just naming the tag this is tiktok view content save it then we go to the preview the view content event is working on node tag assistant connected we are go to the single product now we are check out the tiktok pixel helper Click it. View content is working. Here we see content time. We are putting the product, content name, content ID, all are quantity, currency, all are working properly. Now we go to the tag assistant. Look, see the view content tag is fired. So, congrats, we have successfully set up a view content image for tiktok pixel with gtm thanks for watching and i will see you in the next video